hello friends and i hope you are fine and in this video i am going to tell you ultimately and finally how you can play taken 7 on your pc and uh, like online gaming in taken 7 how you can play online matches in taken 7 on your pc i am repeating on your pcs the trick for pc so i've been stumbling my head for this trick from the today morning and now finally i got this trick so there are various 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 other videos on youtube telling you how you can actually do that like uh, uh, some people tell you to change the IP address, which is completely wrong trick. Once you change your IP address, if, especially when you're connected to Wi-Fi, it uh, will uh, just block your internet connection and you won't be able to use even internet then. So guys, this is not the uh, true trick. Now, somewhere you would have seen that it uh, has to be done using Steam in there. Yeah, it is somewhat correct and somewhere you must have seen that you need to install any specific crack for that so what you are actually supposed to do is to combine these two things so how i got it over i'll show you like this it was and and one more thing and one more thing one, they say you to uh, change the ip address so that you can connect to the players in japan so it is completely wrong whenever you connect to the uh, try to con uh, do any online match it uh, itself asks you if you want the players from the same region or from others region also so there you can select any to compete with the players of the other other regions like america japan and all that so for that what we're supposed to do so now guys moving on as you can see you can see friends these two files i have provided a link to these two files in the description below go to that go to that link and download these two files and then what you're supposed to do you have to copy the file named as a, a step one you have to first extract both of the files and then you have to copy the file named as a step one into the root of the taken 7 folder over here and then what you're supposed to do it's not over then you have to copy the file with the, that is named as step 2 and you have to extract that uh, file obviously and then you have to copy it, it again into the root of your taken 7 folder over here so guys and then after this maybe you have done this trick and still the game hangs so it is because uh, the uh, you open up the game it asks you to select your region the uh, country uh, Asia and uh, Japan anything as such and then it asks you to uh, select your language uh, between those three languages English Japanese and Chinese and then after that what happens is guys you can see the two files being uploaded over here uh, currently so guys uh, maybe after that uh, your game hangs so the next step you have to download steam as I just show showed you uh, you have to download this steam it is of about one point something mb uh, of uh, available to download from its official website and then you have to just log in into your steam account go to add a game add a non steam game you have to go over here at game add a non steam game and then uh, this web windows will pop up where you can add any game so if you have extracted taken uh, seven then it would not be displayed over here so you can add it from here add selected uh, as i just showed you and now you can play the game uh, you have to play the game from here you have to click on play and then the uh, game will run so i show you so guys you have to click over here and the play button and then the screen of the game then the game will start to run and the proof yeah one more thing i that i forgot to tell you you have to enable the game to be run to run as administrator you can do that as follows go to the uh, location where your, where your game is installed like or here it's installed in this section and then you have to right click on the game icon go to properties and then you have to go into compatibility settings uh or here and then you have to select this runs program as an administrator you have to select this option you have to take it then click ok and now you have i've already done it so i'm not going to show you again so you it will ask you to run the game as administrator you have to click yes and then guys the game will start and like this so one of the other proofs that your game is working correctly is that as you can see guys the game is starting and then when the game will start 
when the game will start you will see this option on the down right screen access the steam community while playing it means that this steam is now connected to your game and now you can actually do online gaming with the help of steam steam enables online gaming in any of the computer applications now, so now the game will run and if your game hangs after that those three options yeah it will not happen again so uh, then you have to just go in next and you can see another new option is added over here that is the store option uh, this new option also uh, signifies that the game is now playable online and if it is a, a part of steam actually and now you can anytime press shift plus tab to add your steam uh, gamers uh, your friends in steam i currently have no friends in steam so it's showing me you have zero friends uh, online so then you can play with your friends that are uh, you connected to on steam if you don't want to play with them you just want to play online randomly a ranked match or anything else like tournament then you should just go to online match and just select whatsoever you do and the one more proof that it will happen is that it, whenever you go to quick match now when the game is available to be played online so you have and you will begin search if you have good internet connection you should you should search for uh, more than three network bars players so that the game plays is good and there's no connection loss in between the game so here it comes the option to select the player and once you have done that guys i'm selecting my player and one more thing you i'm going to tell you your saved data will be lost your saved data will be lost after doing this so if you have customized any of your characters it will be lost after uh, doing uh, this and now you can see this searching for open in screen is now visible which was not previously visible when the game was not able to be played online but now this option is available to uh, friends so it and after searching for uh, open it it takes some time to search for open it and sometimes it, it just finds an opponent very fast and other times it takes a lot of time and one more thing i like to show you whenever you went to leaderboards if you uh, did so previously the game closed unexpectedly with an error but now it won't happen and you will be able to see the leaderboard over here like this if your game unexpectedly closes whenever you go inside the uh, inside this option of the lead of this leaderboards option then it means that your game is uh, not playable online and you cannot do online matches and now as you can do online matches the leaderboard option is also available so friends i hope you like the video and if you suffer from any kind of issues doing this uh, implementing this trick in your on your pc or on your laptop then just will comment below in the comment box so that i can help you and don't forget to subscribe like and share bye bye